Ready. Good morning, everybody. Oh, that's a neat shot. Hey, Billy in the mirror. Mm. <laughs> Listerine Billy. We are just getting ready for a pop-up. It is about 7 a.m. Uh, so we are just getting ourselves looking all right. <laughs> and we're gonna go pack up, uh, take inventory of all the plants that we have, get them loaded into the car, get them downtown. Are you ready, Billy? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let's do this. Okay, now comes <laughs> the Jenga part, reverse Jenga, Tetris. Yes. Yeah, no, we have so many different sizes of plants that we've tried to figure out different ways to stack them in the car and move them around. So we put small things in big boxes so I could put the lid on. Because when you put big things in big boxes, they stick out the top. So it's like trying to, yeah, Jenga, Tetris, the whole thing. <laughs> it's probably the struggle of having a pop-up with plants and living creatures. Like yes, that. like let's get all of this stuff, plus some stuff behind me, put it in the car. We do it every time, and it looks funky in the car, so just get ready. Leave me hanging. I didn't know what you were doing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we did it. I didn't really stack things like I wanted, so now we're taking two cars. Sometimes it's easier just to cut the cord and say, let's not go crazy. Load up two cars instead of one. Yeah, but uh, yeah, we need to take two cars because there's legit nowhere for me to sit and nowhere for sort of half of this amount of plants to fit also that are in the other car. I thought I had it all, and then I went inside and I saw there were like eight more boxes, and I was like, you can take the, <laughs> take the hybrid. <laughs> <laughs> two cars are necessary. All right, let's do it. Okay, we made it. Everything is here. Successfully. Now we just have to set up in the cafe. We're at Public Espresso, one of our favorite coffee shops, one of our favorite places to hang out and to pop up. So uh, there's already a line of people waiting for coffee, so we need to get set up right away. Okay, it took us a second, but the spread is set up. We have a lot of stuff today. We have a nice mix of our usual tropical stuff, some desert stuff, some Billy Bob. Just little old me. <laughs> I like that we got these two bigger guys this time too, the canes. Those are really nice. Yeah, a yucca cane and a mass cane, also called a corn plant. People have been saying they wanted bigger stuff, right? So it's a good like it's experiment. That time of year. People don't mind carrying it outside. <laughs> It is food time because anytime we have a little bit of a dip in people being here, we eat all of the food and drink all of the coffee. It's delicious. That's why it's great to have a pop-up at a cafe. Can't go wrong. Okay. It is the end of the first day of our pop-ups. We just restocked the table because it had some pretty big holes in it. <laughs> we did some damage today, which is always good. Um, so we're just doing our final sort of like resetting because we are here, same location tomorrow um, for another day of pop-ups. And it should be really busy tomorrow because it's a holiday. So looking forward to that. But you can see here's our spread. So yeah, now I think we'll uh, sort of go home we'll talk about what we sold today we'll talk about about uh any changes that we want to make for tomorrow figure out like oh people really like this people had a lot of questions about this people weren't so into this so what could we do to bring some interest to some other things you know do a little assessment and then we'll be back at it and we're home we did it <laughs> yeah. day one of the pop-up is over day two tomorrow 
Um, but it was a good day. Yeah, we were able to set the table up again with all of the reinforcements we had. So yes. we have a full stock table again, which is a good sign for tomorrow because it'll be busy on Sunday. Yeah, it's gonna be busy. And you know, but the pop-ups are so fun because it gives us the chance to like in smaller quantities, see what people like, see what they're mm -hmm. asking for, answer their questions. That's why we started pop-ups. The yeah. pop-ups give us the data and information, which it sounds so technical, but it really is. Like I you see what that. people want. I see the mm -hmm. prices people want to pay. Mm -hmm. It helps me know what to go look for when I go to all the nurseries and start driving around throughout New York State and Ontario. It's like that's... I need to know what to look for. Yeah. I need to know what people want. And I will say it's really fun when we get repeat customers that like, we're like, oh, I was waiting for your next one. Yeah. And like, I love it. And when, sometimes people will come right when we open because they were like, oh, I saw you posted on Instagram that you were going to have this plant and I needed to get one. Yeah. So I came first thing. It's like, that's such a nice It's feeling. nice to have customers who potentially may end up being friends because it's like they may be in all the time and they have the same interest and mm -hmm. it makes me happy. That's how the hashtag plant fam works, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Make sure you're following us and check out our website, daddiesplants.com, so you can see um, news and where we're popping up next and uh, hopefully we'll be looking for an actual store sometimes in the future, mm -hmm. so we'll keep you posted on that. So yeah. make sure you're following. I'm gonna go take a nap. Me too. <laughs> all right guys, we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. I spy a pat eating in the wilderness right now.